Hey guys and welcome back. So in between I glued these carbon fiber push rods together, printed out a jig and attached them to uh, two vertical open beams when they were still not assembled. And now they should all have kind of the same length will not be perfect but as close as we can get it. Now that your rods are ready you can push in the ball joints just lay them on the table and press down and repeat that for all of the rest. Once you have them all pressed in Take your bolt, slide it through the ball, place a lock nut on the back and tighten the bolt down firmly. Now we can connect the diagonal rods to the vertical sliders, just take a bolt and place a lock nut on the back and tighten them down. And make sure it moves nice and smooth. Next we're gonna place our unstop blocks already on the vertical beams. Next I put the top back on so I could insert the bolt and not for the belt tensioning. And now comes the fun part, so take your belt, slide it through the bottom, through the carriage and over the top and loop it around and the belt, the grooves of the belt will lock itself up and it's some fiddling to get all the belts kind of the same tension so you will have to do it once or twice now that the belts are attached the effector will stay in place in the air and we can connect a hot end to it to so slide your PDF heat tubing through it next take some bolts and M3 nuts and connect it to the effector and once your hands are free, you can also place the part for the auto leveling probe on there. So you can tighten it down with the hot end. Again, thanks for watching and see you on the next episode.